What's up guys, Prodigy here and before all the PlayStation 4 and PlayStation users kill me because you know I did a few videos on the PlayStation 4 and showed you some of the errors that it had like the you know the blue light of death, the red light of death and I don't know what else, I only did two videos though. Um, they jumped my inbox, they jumped my freaking Facebook messages, they jumped my comments, they're like, oh, you talk shit about the PlayStation 4, you showed the problems that it had, but now that the Xbox has issues, you don't want to talk about it? I was like, what issues? I'm like, and then they, they're telling me that, oh, there's the faulty disc tray, and it's not working, so I looked it up, and according to this website right here, videogamer.com, it says some early adopters of the Xbox One has been failing having like this great issues is not reading the optical disc and here's exactly what happens i'm gonna go ahead and play this quick video the few seconds at the end <laughs> it does that retarded ass motherfucking noise and it does not read the disc i heard some games work some games don't according to arctic like if you don't know about arctic he's like in the competitive seat of the whole gaming like pc xbox he's really competitive and stuff and he had one of these problems, one of these Xbox that was not, you know, reading discs. And he made a pretty funny video. I'll have his link in the description. Um, but, damn, that sucks. It really does suck. But before I start talking about this right now really quick, I'm not saying this is okay. I'm not saying it's all right for it to have issues. But the Xbox One problem right now, from what I've heard from the stuff that I looked up, it's only the disc string. It does not brick the console. Everything works perfectly fine, just like it should. You can still play. Some games are heard. Some games don't work. But you can still buy your games online, download them, install them to the console, and play online. Before you start jumping at me saying you're defending it, yes, I'm defending it because it's not a brick. Like, it's not a brick. They don't have to wait almost till February because, you know, some of you might not know about this, but because x uh playstation 4 sold so many consoles that were sold out for they're even on back order right now that's how many consoles they sold to the point that the people that are having issues right now with their console they won't get the new console till like probably a couple months from now because there isn't any they're just no playstation 4 and the people that are having issues are not gonna get their new shit until like a couple months later that really does suck, man. I really feel bad for you guys. The people are, are going through this. I heard some people are not. Some people are getting them right away. But from uh, the places that I have checked up, people were saying that since this shit is on back order and there's no more PlayStation 4, the people that are having trouble with it are not going to get their new ones till like a couple months later. But back to the Xbox One, it is pretty fucked up, Microsoft. Uh, pay we paid almost five, $600 for a console. We want it to be fucking perfectly working fine. Like, we want no issues, no problems, and that's pretty fucked up. But this is it, guys. Really stick around for my next video. It's pretty funny. It's something about PlayStation 4 and what the fuck they've been doing with this shit. But anyways, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like. If you have any questions, leave a comment, and I'll see you guys later. Peace. <laughs>